you can see here a little goose recognizes us and he wants some bread it's crystal here and we've just come to feed the ducks basically what i've been doing is i've been going to the feed share at wycliffe baptist church and i've been getting bread but quite often quite often the bread isn't fit to eat so we've been going taking a, a couple of minute walk to the i think it's the kinnick now and we've been taking this bread from Wycliffe Church that we've been given and feeding it to the geese. So basically, my boyfriend, he's uh, feeding the geese right now while I video the geese being fed. Um, I'm sure Wycliffe wouldn't be very happy to know that um, I'm giving this bread <laughs> to the geese because they would probably say that I can't have it if they knew I was feeding it to the geese because they would say well they're going to give it to families but to be quite honest some of that bread isn't really edible for fit for human consumption because it's really hard it just so happens that the bread we're giving the geese now is edible for human consumption but i had gone to the shop and i had bought some bread that was within its best by date so the bread that we're given to the geese has passed its best by date anyway so it shouldn't be any big deal but i'm still not going to tell the people at Wyclem that i've been feeding the geese with the bread they've been giving me because i don't think they would be very happy you can see how excited the geese are they love the bread i mean strictly speaking you're not supposed to be feeding geese and ducks and chickens or anybody else any other fowl for that matter bread because bread really isn't good for them but and so people were being told don't feed the birds bread so people stopped feeding the birds bread and then the the birds just started starving because they were reliant upon the bread that humans were giving them to eat, even if it wasn't very good for them. So then they went and changed their stance and they said, well, we know bread isn't very good for the birds, but go ahead and give the birds bread because they're starving. So now the birds are being given bread, even though it's not very good for them. But this particular batch of bread that we're giving the birds today has seeds in it now i personally don't know what kind of um food a geese and ducks need but i've been giving them bread because a little bit of bread has got calories in it and it's enough to keep them alive and that's what's important is keeping them alive I hope you like this video. This video is a break from my normal tarot videos, but it's just letting you know what I'm doing during lockdown. So this canal is about a couple of minute walk from where I live, but I wouldn't go on the canal by myself. I would always go with somebody. And the reason why is because I have respiratory disease and if somebody who did not mean me well was to come upon me you know i wouldn't fare very well because of my lung disease um and that's about it really i just thought you might like a break from typo and you might like to see a little bit of my life and see how we feed we've been feeding the geese during lockdown and that's something that I'm going to keep up as long as I'm getting bread from Whitefoot Baptist Church to feed the geese. Then I will carry on walking to the canal and feeding the geese. Here's another wildlife. That's my boyfriend. He's feeding them while I video this. So if you like my video, please like, subscribe, and share. And if you want to leave a donation, I've got my email address for PayPal below. 
uh, any donations I get are gratefully received and uh, help me at least buy some bread to feed the geese. So I hope you have a very nice day and goodbye.